Helen Hunt Jackson is a 19th century activist for Indian rights and a novelist and a poet, and she's quite famous in her lifetime. She moves to Colorado Springs and marries William S. Jackson here in 1875. Ten years after she marries William S. Jackson, she dies. They've had no children. Right before she dies, she says, you know what, I'm going to die. You should marry our niece, whose name is also Helen. That's Helen Banfield. That's Helen Banfield Jackson that we're talking about today. Helen Banfield marries William S. Jackson in 1888, so about three years after her aunt has died. They have seven children, um, quite rapidly. Margaret Jackson, here the youngest, dies as an infant. She dies before her first birthday, and a few months after Margaret dies, Helen Banfield Jackson uh, shoots herself with a rifle and dies. She kept quite extensive diaries, and uh, they give us more insight into her mind than many diaries of the period do. This final diary, the, the one that goes right up to the day she killed herself, ends with the word, 